Hello, I am Dr. Shubhendu Mandal. I am pediatric cardiologist at BM Birla Heart Research Center. At the very beginning, I wish best wishes for the World Heart Day. And today, I'll just briefly discuss about congenital heart disease. How do they present and what to do? It comes as a shock to the family when a child is born, when they are in realm of joy and suddenly they are told that their child has got a heart disease and they should visit a cardiac center. Now what is congenital heart disease? It is basically a developmental defect which starts in utero when the mother is pregnant and during the development of the heart there are some defects which present when the child is being born. Nowadays you can do fetal echocardiography but it is not routinely recommended and sometimes the only recommendation remains when you have got one child already affected in the heart disease so or one of the parents have got heart disease then you do a fetal echocardiography otherwise it is not routinely done however when the heart is being developed these defects can be minor or major for that just briefly i must tell you that heart has got four chambers two atrium two ventricle and two great vessels which come out from the heart the pulmonary artery and aorta this is basic understanding and during development there can be minor defects like holes in the top chamber which is called asd which or a small hole or holes in the lower chamber which is called ventricular septal defect and sometimes a connection between two great arteries which is called PDA. These are very common uh, defects which accounts for 30 to 40 percent of the cases. However, sometimes the defects can be very complicated where the chambers maybe the either the right or the left are not developed or the great arteries like the pulmonary artery or aorta they don't arise from their respective chambers in sometimes they are other way around or they can arise from one chamber the valves may be defective or even blood flow to through these great vessels can be obstructed and they present with cyanosis or bluish discoloration in children if the defect is complex or if it is very large most of these children will need some sort of intervention in at the early infancy so when a child presents with very bluish discoloration or a heart murmur it is usually initially picked up by your pediatrician who are the first liner and nowadays i must appreciate lot of pediatricians are picking up these problems and referring them to a pediatric cardiologist please do not neglect if your child has got some sort of suspicion of congenital heart disease do attend a pediatric cardiologist in any well-known cardiac centers and so that the planning of management whether he the child needs surgery or whether the child needs some sort of intervention or some follow-up can be planned by the cardiologist so my good wishes for the world heart day to keep your child checked up by a pediatric cardiologist in cases of suspicion or even in sometimes if the child is not growing well child is sweating no, uh, having respiratory ble uh, distress or having repeated chest, chest infection you have a freedom to contact a pediatric cardiologist and get it checked and make have a peace of mind that your child is not suffering from any serious heart disease Thank you and best wishes.